so this is current shopping center and by the way i keep asking myself every other time why this uh, small town is like this it's always like this it doesn't change yeah sometime before i came to uh, karen i used to pe hear people talk of karen 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 and i'm like hey that must be a very big city yeah, but the time i came here i was like ah this is how karen is so welcome again to this uh, vlog uh, thank you for watching my videos and thank you for joining this family thank you for subscribing um, uh, if you are from kenya uh, God bless you from US, God bless you from the UK, from uh, China, from uh, South Africa, from Ghana, from across the world, Jamaica. Thank you for supporting me and guys I welcome you back to this channel and uh, in today's video I want to take you around current neighborhood, current neighborhood. I've actually uploaded a video for you uh, from the neighborhood but uh, I did not go around the place the way i should have done so today i'm taking you around the current neighborhood guys so right now i'm at around cooperative university so i was just stopping i just stopped somewhere uh, yes yeah, to do the intro and so let's go guys uh, let's go let's go let's go guys we just get to see uh, this place okay so this is a uh, uh, this is Cooperative University. This is Cooperative University right here. Uh, that is where it is situated. And so um, we'll take. We'll be taking the right, the left uh, 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 road. Oh, oh, yeah. So this is Cooperative University, guys. Uh, this is where it is situated. And of course, uh, David Unia, who is my friend. Uh, this way used to study but we will not proceed to Hadi we'll be taking uh, the left uh, the left uh, road right here yeah which takes us all the way to Karen so guys I want us to explore this place a little bit um, before uh, time goes before it gets dark and of course right now it's around uh, 5 in the evening here in Kenya guys if you're watching this video you can tell uh, us where you're watching this video from uh, so um, I can't recall the name of this road right here uh, but uh, we just move moving around uh, to connect uh, the current uh, road you know guys to connect with the current road and so let's go yeah so cooperative university is just right behind me so guys let's let's explore a current neighborhood um i hope we'll be able to uh go around the place before it gets dark yeah so i hope time time is going to allow us to do this so you see the way that bus is going that's how we'll be going yeah. so so guys the last time i, I passed here uh, is uh, i think a month or two months ago and i can see some medinas has been done on this road uh, sorry guys uh, i'm shooting this video and my camera is facing the sun so we may have some issues i hope uh, you understand because uh, i don't think if the video is going to be uh, that good but uh, yeah so you see some medinas has been done on this road and uh, this is not how it used to be yeah, you see um, it has been uh, recarpeted and so it used to be a very bad road before it used to be a very bad before uh, road but uh, very bad road before it had a lot of portals but i see uh, maybe the area mp or 
maybe the MCA is doing some good uh, work. You even see there is a red, uh, 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 a yellow line in between, which never used to be here. Yeah. So, current neighborhood is a rich neighborhood. Uh, this is where most rich people live. But uh, I don't know why the roads are never that good. Yeah. But uh, for now, we can see some Medinas is being carried on. And so, um, the roads are looking, uh, this one right here is looking better. So I hope uh, the same is being done on most of the roads here. So I won't complain before I see uh, how the other roads are looking like. So guys, uh, if you live in this place, maybe you can uh, go to the comment section and you tell me what you're thinking, uh, what you're thinking about this video. So, guys, uh, I ordered uh, some some accessories for this camera because uh, sometimes when uh, I'm filming, it's very hard for me. I'm also when uh, maybe I'm on the road, I'm driving, it becomes so hard for me to hold the camera. So I need some uh, stuff to stick here on the uh, windscreen so that it becomes easier for me to or film and also to give you a proper, uh, proper uh, or nice footages from this camera. Because when I hold it, sometimes it shakes, sometimes the videos uh, do not come out too well. Yeah. So we're taking Bogani Road. This is Bogani Road. Yeah. Um, it's the uh, one. Uh, that's from uh, Catholic University and so this is the road we are taking right now so as you can see guys uh, this road remains the same it has not been recarpeted or any maintenance has not carried been carried on, on it even though, they, okay, there are some Medina, I can see there are some, there's some Medinas that has been done because there used to be some portals and I don't see the portals um, and uh, the road seems to be breaking. I think it's because uh, it's a substandard road. Yeah. It's substandard. It's not uh, of, uh, I don't know which class is th this road is, guys. Uh, maybe the civil engineers in this group can tell us. You are even in construction. What do you call this kind of class of uh, roads? Yeah. Uh, what is built to main standard? You know, I don't know all those terms, guys. You can tell us. So, guys, the video may not be uh, good. But let's see how it goes. So this is where current medical training college is situated. It's not far away from here, guys. And uh, I know, guys. I already gave you a video from here, and uh, I remember on that day. Uh -huh. I was uh, I was going somewhere. Where was I going? <laughs> because I remember I joined the uh, Southern Bypass and I went all the way to Mombasa Road, and so I did not go around the, this area. So hopefully, I'll be able to give you a proper tour from this place. So let's go. You guys can tell me what you think about these roads and um, according to my thinking current needs to have better roads
this is where current uh, country cl- club is uh, situated right inside so this fence you are seeing right here is for current uh, country club By the way, my camera is overheating. I don't know why. Let's explore this place, guys. I hope you enjoy. You're going to enjoy this video. And let's explore Karen, guys. So now uh, this is Langat Road. Um, we've just joined uh, Langat Road, and so I made it to current shopping center right now. I'm actually added to current shopping center. I hope guys, you hearing me loud and clear. So I don't know what happened to this road. Uh, it seems the contractor uh, left it uh, at this stage. The road has not has no markings. I don't know it has not been marked. Yeah. But then it's kind of it's huge when it's coming from right behind me. When it reaches here, it becomes uh, kind of narrow. I don't know, guys. You can tell me in the comment section why you think the road is uh, like this. I was I was not seeing that. Imagine there is a bounce there and I can't even see it. There is also another one here. Yeah. The good thing is uh, the bounce are um, kind of friendly. So this is current shopping center. And by the way, I keep asking myself every other time why this uh, small town is like this. It's always like this. It doesn't change. Yeah. Sometime before I came to uh, Karen, I used to pe- hear people talk of Karen, 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 and I'm like, hey, that must be a very big city. Yeah. But the time I came here, I was like, ah, this is how Karen is. So Karen is always small. So just a small shopping center. I don't know why it doesn't develop that much. Yeah, so it's a neighborhood that has its secrets, but you know, guys, um, it's kind of the rich do, uh, do not love seeing uh, a lot of people. Uh, are living where they are. This English is Englishing. So, guys, this is a current roundabout right here, and current police station on the other side. So we'll go all the way to towards the um, current hub. Is it current hub or what? The big mall right here, a shopping center. And so I, I hope, guys, you love this tour. Uh, Sometimes it takes a lot to bring these videos. Okay. It takes a lot, but uh, I've actually been thinking of uh, 
either looking for a motorbike or maybe hiring some motorbike guy to uh, at least help. So this guy in Aham, guys, right here, it's a shopping mall. Yeah, so actually filming these videos in uh, a motorbike is kind of cool and more better uh, than uh, filming from the gas because it's kind of the wind skin affects uh, uh, the videos. So. So I'm supposed to make a turn right here, but uh, I, I need to proceed to this side. Yeah. If you continue on this road, you'll go all the way to Kikuyu and those other places. Uh, yeah. Uh, near uh, uh, Karen. So let me give this guy. Okay. So let's proceed, guys. So this is the current neighborhood. Inside these places are some maybe offices, uh, organizations, and um, and uh, houses for the rich. So. So guys, I'm going back now. Um, and you see, there are a lot of photos, big ones here. If you hit one with your car, then uh, be be sure that you'll get a major damage damage in your car. So let's go back. So we are back to uh, current current shopping center. Uh, you can see. There are a lot of businesses uh, happening right here and you see even this road has some portals guys so it's not that good and it's in the shopping center you imagine that uh, so uh, we'll take gong road on the uh, left side uh, proceed towards the Nairobi city Now we are going to take a turn here and head uh, towards a uh, current road again. And, uh, a 
I've seen a guy take a wrong turn here. Oh, was he at it too? So now again the sun. <laughs> so yeah. And so now my camera has started overheating again. So guys, this is the waterfront. Okay. Let's proceed further on this on current road. So uh, now, um, I'm going to take, uh, I'm actually at Karen Road, but I'm actually taking uh, Langat Road now, uh, as I head towards, uh, um, I'm actually taking Langat Road right now, as I head towards uh, the Bomas or Garelia. So I still want to show you how this video is, guys. So. Uh, you can go to the comment section and you tell me what you think about this road. Do the current residents deserve such roads? Or residents? Do the current residents deserve such uh, roads? So anyway, in one way or another, even and uh, current residents use this road. Actually, majority of them are the ones who use these roads. But as Kenyans, do we deserve to have such uh, roads in such a resident residence? Yeah. So I'll be taking uh, Dege Road. I'll be taking Dege Road. Uh, um, so guys, the watermark business park is situated right here. And so let's take the girl on and see. So this is Bogani Road again, I'm actually back, and so
guys my fuel gauge has dropped and so hey this is a big neighborhood guys we can't even be able to cover this uh, in in an hour and you know uh, this video has to be like in a, an hour or less i don't want to start uh, struggling uh, in uploading such a big video guys and also editing is quite uh, involving uh, with the kind of uh, computer i have so i want to look for a better computer uh, so that the software i'm using won't give me problems for now for now i have to most of the time i had it using my phone so it's kind of a big challenge so my my fuel gauge has dropped so i really have to refuel guys you see uh, see the, such roads can you imagine such big portals in current neighborhood So this way where the red car is going, uh, that is a uh, uh, car Adi, but because uh, I want to explore Karen further, we still have to proceed this way so that I also uh, fill in the petrol station. Uh, this building you are seeing here is uh, for parliamentary, it's called parliamentary center. Hey, parliamentary training center or something. Let's see if we can read. Uh, yeah, parliamentary studies and training center. That building you are seeing there, still uh, under construction. today but uh, I love this camera for reason one because I can film for like two hours without it, uh, heat overheating I like uh, the GoPro guys it really overheats I've had uh, the GoPro uh, people or people who use GoPros complain a lot by uh, of uh, the, uh, the, the, the overheating it's really a big problem and that's why I had to choose this one when I was buying this camera, I was comparing, you know, the two cameras, GoPro 11 and this one. And I still find this one more better. I don't know why. It's not like I don't like uh, GoPros because soon as I'll be purchasing a GoPro also. Yeah. Because I have bigger plans for this channel. Please continue supporting me, continue subscribing. Uh, you can always comment, guys. Every time I see a comment, I feel very great so don't just watch my videos and go away guys please uh, comment when I read your comments be it negative or positive I feel very nice you know that makes me feel good I know that people are watching me or are watching my my my, my videos it is very bad to create videos and then um, you 
find no comment in your videos. Uh, it kind of feels bad or bad, guys. So kindly always uh, leave a comment every other time you watch our videos or my videos. Yeah. It really re-energizes me, you know. That makes me feel like I want to create more videos, guys. Eh? All time. There's a small mall here. Uh, one stop ahead. It's not small, guys. It's a big mall, of course. But it's not as big as we are used to the other malls here in Nairobi. So. <sighs> so, now we are at the junction of... Um, this road is called uh, yeah, Langata South Road because we are at the junction of Langata South Road and Langata Road and so let's explore further uh, and now we are headed to uh, Karen uh, not Karen but uh, uh, Garelia we are headed to the Garelia guys uh, and the reason why I brought you here is because Karen is also part of this um, this road here and Garelia but um, yes the reason why I've come here guys is uh, that I want to access this petrol station right here because my gauge has gone down and I don't feel like um, I should uh, just go like that blindly otherwise um, I'll be looking for a jerk. This is to fuel my car. This is really very sad. So, let's refuel here. And um, uh, proceed further. Yeah, so I hope guys you are enjoying uh, my videos. And particularly this video. Yeah, so for those who are still in the dark, I'm trying to explore Karen and um, i want to give you a proper uh, current tour so i hope you are going to like it please uh, leave a thumbs up you can also comment uh, and share my video so let's try to refuel right here how to refuel right here at this uh, petrol station and um, yeah So guys, I'm actually refueling. Um, as you can see right there, I'm refueling so that um, we proceed with the tour, the Karen neighborhood tour. So let's wait for the uh, uh, attendant to finish up and proceed.
love filming uh, during the day so that at least we film better videos you know or oh, film a good video for you guys So I hope you guys
doing your sales. Uh, I'm actually doing it right here. Uh, this is what I'm doing. Maybe this time in a motorbike. So guys, see you next time.